guys, it's lunchtime, and I've just taken a nap, so I look like a, a mess. But that's not what I am gonna talk about here, because I'm gonna talk about this. I am gonna talk about this. This is one of the reason why I uh, have decided to film this. It is a traditional food that you might find it a bit hard to find it nowadays in Japanese we call it puli so what is puli well today we had some leftover rice well it's expired as a rice but it's not expired as something else something like puli so we can make something from the rice from the leftover rice i mean yes first of all we uh grinded it so, so the leftover rice was grinded they became stick together something like that and then my mom uh cut the rice into small pieces something like this okay i want I'm, i will show you this see there are some small pieces of the rice that had been grinded by mom so there are lots of ways to enjoy this puli food first of all we can pour some peanut sauce into it second of all you can fry it and eat it and that's it and third of all this is another method, another way to enjoy puli. You made some kind of a syrup, yes, from sugar, brown sugar, or any kind of sugar that you turned into syrup, and you put it here. And then there's one specific ingredient that you need to add to make it, to make the taste savory, and that is um, grated coconut. Can you see? Uh, okay, okay, let me see. Okay, let me see. I'm gonna eat it. And then I'm gonna show the grated coconut. Here it is. <laughs> this is the coconut that we pour on top of the puli with the syrup. So it made this food somehow desserty because it's sweet and savory and you don't consume it for your like main menu mm -hmm. so it's like something that you eat for the opener for the for the opener or for them for the end of your menu for your eating session i don't know i think somehow it tastes like a dessert Thank you for watching and have a great lunch.